So three cubs have actually snuck off away from mum, gone on their own little adventure, dropped down the edge of the bank and gone drinking. All these crocs around us absolutely insane. See some crocodiles moving over there, actually, in the water. Rose's cubs are too young to understand the danger they're in. Now, these really are the cheekiest little cubs. I mean, they really haven't quite learned a sort of healthy fear for the, uh, the crocodiles yet. They're drinking at the edge, particularly without any parents near them. There's a high chance that a croc could take one. Unfortunately, we're not allowed to intervene. We have to let nature sort of take its course. The cubs have been gone for 10 minutes before Rosa realizes they're missing. She's trying to see where they are. I don't think she actually saw where they've gone. She's looking a bit uncertain. Rosa chooses to search upstream in the wrong direction. It's their aunt Zuri who hears the cubs' distant calls. She got up and ran across trying to help. She can hear them, but she can't see them. The cubs have got themselves onto a rocky ledge. They might be stuck down there. I mean, this is pretty dangerous for the cubs because it's very easy for them to slip and fall down. There's a crocodile coming. Crazy. Zuri is desperate to help them. But she can't risk her cubs coming with her. It's a pretty steep bank there, and I think you can see here the mother really doesn't want the cubs to go. She's grabbing them and pulling them back again. She tries to leave her cubs with their grandmother. She can't persuade her cubs to stay behind. Spotty finds a route out. It's a welcome reunion with their aunt. 